In this video, we are going to see about the subtraction method. How we can do uh, binary subtraction of signed numbers. Signed binary numbers. When the sign of A and B are different, then add the magnitudes and attach the sign of A to the result. When both the signs are same, first you will take two values and you will check the sign. Okay. When both signs are same, then you add those values and attach the uh, yes sign with. Suppose both are different only, we go for subtraction. Okay, so when the sign of A and B, sign bit is, you know, the most significant bit. When the sign bit are different, then that means one is plus and one is minus. Okay, so add the magnitudes and attach the sign of A to the result. Otherwise, compare the magnitudes and subtract the smaller number from the larger. So how you will do? Choose the sign of the result to be same as A if A is greater than B. Uh, complement of sign if A is less than B. And if A equal to B, subtract B from A and make the sign of the result to be positive. Now we will see the sign bit subtraction. So plus A minus minus B. So what you will do? You will do the... Uh, a minus B. Here, if you take minus minus, it becomes plus. Okay. So, and you attach the sign bit of A. Then minus A minus A minus plus B. So, which means you substitute the subtraction, uh, the sign bit of A. So, which is nothing but minus A plus B. So, if it is plus A minus plus B, then what you will do? If it is A is greater than B, in this case, you check whether A is greater than B or not. Then you do like this. If it is greater A minus B, substitute the sign of A. If A is less than B, substitute the sign bit of B. Then A is equal to B means you do A minus B, you will get a zero value. And the uh, uh, sign bit will be plus. So if both are same, then what happened? Here again, you take the subtraction symbol outside, that is sign bit. And do a minus b here. If this a is less than b, then b minus a and attach the uh, that is positive symbol for it. And then a minus b again it is zero, so it has the positive symbol. Then flowchart for sub, uh, the same way. What we have seen here is the flowchart for the subtract operation. Here again you check the sign bit. Okay, first. You complement the sign bit and then you check whether they are equal. In which case, both sign bit are equal means you have to add the data, both A and B, and substitute the sign bit of A for the result. If no means you check for A is greater than B. If it is greater, then you do A minus because A is bigger. So do the subtraction and attach the sign bit of A for the result. If no means, then you check whether both the numbers are having the same value. In which case, the result will be zero. If you do subtraction, you will be doing subtraction, so you will get a zero. And the sign bit is also will be positive. If it is not, which means B is greater. So you do B minus A, and the sign bit will be, since B is greater, you have to, for the sign bit, you have to attach the sign bit of B only. Finally, it's over. Now, we'll see with this example. Example of subtraction. So plus 3 plus 2 minus you are going to do subtraction. So when there is a subtraction, uh, you will be checking the num uh, both the numbers are having the same sign. Okay, so you will be adding. So what you do is you add 1. For this, anyway, since it is subtraction, you have to find this 2's complement. So which is nothing but for this, you take this 0, 0, 0, 1's complement is this, 1, 1, 0, 1, and 2's complement will be adding 1, so you will get this value, right? So if you see this here, 0, 0, 1, 1, then 2's complement, you both add, you get this, and since 2's complement, you can, uh, uh, this carry bit can be uh, strike out. No need to consider this carry. So this is your output, 0, 0, 0, 1, so positive. When both signs are same, so here, 
both signs are same okay so and the subtraction here for this you have to take uh, for if you take minus 3 as i already told you if there is a negative number you have to do you have to take its whose complement and then only you have to perform the operation so minus 3 is 0, 0, 001 find one's complement it is this and add one to get a two's complement for minus 2 already we have found here okay so you substitute that 1101 one, you substitute here 1110 minus 2 so this is minus 3 and minus 2 representation now we add this one, 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 zero. Then one will be carrying one, 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 triple one, two, one, carry is one. Now, uh, because of two, as we have carried over the two's complement, the carry bit we can be uh, stacked up. No need to consider that. If it is a one's complement, then you have to bring down the carry and then add it. But in two's complement, you can leave up the carry. So here it is minus three. Minus 2 means this minus 5. Now, I, we would like to check whether the answer which we have got is correct or not. Now, 5 is this, this 0, 1, 0, 1. Now find 1's complement is 1, 0, 1, 0. Add 1 with it to have 2's complement. This is nothing but our answer. So, minus 5 is 1, 0, 1, 1.